They're not effectively translating their thoughts into actions. LYW beating the crap out of Ace. There's the boulder in. Not long enough, though. Piao now rip inside of shreds. Did activate that strafe. Getting off a lot of damage with the Searing Arrows. And we get the glimpse back. That might be a dead LYW. Trying to trade his life for Ace. Gets the Empower off. Can he make it? No. Ace. He had like six health there for a second. I'm on fire. Way to feed. Show that fight keep recap there. Big burst. Yeah, it's it's difficult time. Melody trying to proc a pole. Not really doing it, so... Juggernaut's just going to have to push this into the tower. LYW back with some more tangos. I think that was his strategy. He knew he was going to die at some point, so he's like, eh. I'll just pick everything up from the shop later on. And the Clinks does, in fact, go Basilius and Soul Ring. Rather than just splitting the Basilius up. Ooh, that's a very, very fast Psy. They might have the Battle Hunger on it, but guess what? Piao is the one who's doing the feeding. Magnus. Falling pretty low. Getting attacked by a tower. Tries to farm some creeps before he goes down. He realized he was done. Ooh, YYW having a very rough time. Does he have a bottle? Is this bottle growing? Yeah, it's bottle growing. Okay. I was about to say, there's no way he's this poor. The OD going for the Midas. Boulder in hits YYW. He's slow. Pops off his remnant, but... Gets kicked to the face. Sai is doing work with these rotations. Kinda. He was missing out on Piao a bit. But. They get the kinetic field there. The self save. Can it stop Rampage? No, nope, but he just gets Gims back. Yeah. He's gonna be unable to stop Rampage Gaming from getting the kill on the OD there. Juggernaut even TPs in to try to save his life. Oh man, that's painful, because now, instead of safely farming his top lane, the Juggernaut's here, he has, look at this, like, two creeps to farm. Now what's he doing? Standing around. He could be farming camps right now, he could be farming this creep wave right here, but instead, no. So that's a very, very big win for Rampage there, even though it's a very, very small thing. Um, the Axe even taking advantage of the enemy jungle. Like, look at this. Oh, we have the rolling bowl there, and can they get PYW? Who gets himself the call? But they throw him right into that astral imprisonment there. And the Omni Slash will take the kill. Fusheng, though, runs up, gets himself that Slytherin Crush, and here's that ball lightning in. This instant silence, though. Looks like the jug is not going anywhere. Sai, he does rolling bowl there away. Gets out of there. And TP by three. Magnetize is not even used. Not even there. The Axe does get the call off for that mana. But there's the RP on two. This is fantastic. PYW running for his life. He has the Shadow Word on him. Can he survive? He does. Ooh, Fu Sheng helping to turn it around. Takes down that Magnus. And now Sai and Melody, they got to run. Fu Sheng slithering crushing. And can he get it? No. No slithering crushing. Just running up. Throwing a corrosive haze on people. Sprinting around. They get the ball lightning in. Into the glimpse back. Into the static. Oh, man. His OD is having a rough time. Fu Sheng even preemptively throwing down the Slytherin Crush in case someone TPs in to try to save him. The axe. The smoke up. They're going to go on mid. Melody does have the Chaotic Offering available. They hope that they can get them. Maybe Piao can go on the back lines to get them. There's the Blink Slithering Crush. The Chaotic Offering is down, though. Now, they also have the Fatal Bonds. Sai is on the backside. He runs up, tries to take out Ace. Everyone's taking tons of damage. Piao trying to run for his life. I think the Fatal Bonds were giving him away there. PYW also. Oh, man, the Clinks drops. Fu Sheng backing off. So that's a two for two. More so in the favor of all around this bottom tier one tower. He's with a thunder strike and then BAM! YYW is here. He's ready to fight this this guy. PYW yells at him and makes him die.
No, it's not playing around. He just wants to be tanky. He wants to be beefy. Sai missing the mark on that boulder. While well, Fusheng running back. Oh, the double RP. Two very, very critical people for Rampage. And both are down with an Omni Slash to boot. Piao. He needs to pick people off. He's not... Doesn't have the ability to do it. He needs some sort of farm. And there's the OD. Gets the Astral into Sanity's Eclipse. And down falls the storm. Is that enough bait, though? Nope. Rampage already has himself that Force Staff. With so much maneuverability now. The Blink and... Oh, boy. Juggernaut discovers that there was a Roche being taken. Who grabs it? Piao grabs it. There's a Static Storm in the center of all of this madness. The Chaotic Offering is there with the Fatal Bonds. Down falls Piao. PYW in the... Trying to get away. Fusheng also falling. W standing there, jumps in, gets the call at least, but he drops. Fatal Bonds hurt so much. And Ace trying to run for his life. Glimpse back. Might be able to make it. Can he? No. A random right click from Melody will take him down. YYW. He needs that. He's just behind. Like, all of Rampage just feel really behind. They didn't really lose in the laning stage, but they didn't really win either. I, I, it feels like TOT just won it, I guess. Oh, there we are, trying to get away. The Juggernaut manages to at least pop the Omni Slash. There we are. Before dropping, he gets the Omni Slash off, but he doesn't take anyone out. Lots of bounce of Spirit, who is 009. Hasn't died at all, but has accomplished so much just for his team. We have the Static Storm, PYW getting the call. Can he spin around enough? Sai gets dunked in the face. Down he goes. And kills. Just something feels off. Can't really put him. I think it's the super poor Slardar. We'll see if that takes any effect here as he's silenced up, magnetized away. The axe does blink in, gets the call off, but that's another golem freely used. Three man RP. So many. Oh, God, the Chaotic Offer is so good there. With those Fatal Bonds and that RP. Psy taking the double kill. Now this could turn into a Golem push. Such a value, Midas. Getting me Melody to where he needs to be very, very quickly. We're going to look at these levels here. Yeah, level 12 on that, that Warlock. He's been sitting around doing not much. And yet he's still... Used to be like a little tentacle monster thing that like sucked on your head. Oh man, Juggernaut, Omni Slash on a three. He's doing a lot of damage. Trying to take out Fusheng right away. Here's the Magnetize. They're trying to take out this Slardar so he can't control anyone. There's that Chaotic Offering once again. Melody doing everything to his heart's desire. YYW now trying to focus onto the Warlock. But, I mean, the Big Daddy was out. Melody gets that kill with the Golem. They get the call onto the OD, though. Sanity's Eclipse going to take out the Axe along with that OD. A lot of Rampage's pushing power is now worthless. Golem pushing away. It's one of those split games, I guess. No team can really get their foot in the door. So much pinging. Oh, the ball lightning forward, but that's into two dudes. YYW, who can you take out? He chooses the Earth Spirit. Easy pickings. Can he take out LWY as well? Nah, he's going to try to fight this golem for a little bit, but it's just going to time out. Bottom lane, Ace pushing in, getting some farm. He's the poorest. That's all I can really say about the Disruptor. He's the poorest. Um... He's had some good static storms, but I just don't feel like the Disruptor is as effective this game as the Disruptor was last game. Piao thinking about maybe trying to attack. They get the Slytherin. Oh man, that's Strafe. And with the sideline from that storm, that Juggernaut gets annihilated.
spirit. If you want that blink dagger. YYW just pushing in with the creeps a little bit. The rolling boulder and everyone's TPing in now. We get the magnetize along with the silence. Storm Spirit just needs another moment to get out of there. Starts balling around now. PYW here to take the attention away from the enemies. LWY. The, oh, Ace. The Disruptor does get off the Static Storm, but he's going to die. And now, Axe running away. Piao and Fusheng. The, oh, they find themselves in OD, and they rip them apart. Do get the Astral on the Clinks, but... That ain't gonna cut it. Warlock, level 3, Chaotic Offering, Golem Hurts. Ooh, have some action. Sai stumbles into something. Throws out a random boulder. There we are. Nice RP. Seven. There we are. Sanity's Eclipse is out. There's the Chaotic Offering and chopping down PWY. Doesn't matter how many blade mails he has, how much armor he has, he's just going to get ripped apart there. And YYW. YYW jumping in. He's got one to try to at least take down this Warlock, but just can't succeed. Get the glimpse back onto this Magnus. A consolation prize for Rampage. But that's some some teamwork right here from uh, to be or not to be. They're moving as a crew. They engage on the axe. They jump in, shred him apart. No buyback available on that axe. YYW trying to push out the wave a bit with that. Running in mid. Wherever they at least expect. Ooh, Psy jumping in. They get the stun. They get the silence. And then there's the chaotic offering. Agonims. No, not a Agonims chaotic offering. And now with the Warlock Golem. It's uh, going to be forcing a buyback here. As to be or not to be, they just move bottom. They're interested in these melee racks, and that's about it. This Golem hitting so hard. Down falls the tower. Piao on the sidelines. Starts trying to pick off this Golem. We get the call on the Axe, but a very quick defensive Astral on that Juggernaut. Storm. Jumping in as that with that Shiva's Sanity's Eclipse not really doing too much damage there. The glimpse back. Omni Slash just picking off everyone. That's a two for McDoofer there for the Juggernaut. You're a little too preemptive with your uh, your assault. And now oh extremely tanky axe. He actually has himself a Yules. That's kinda sad. Here comes the storm, and he steals that Aegis. He snatches Rooney. Oh boy, the axe though getting shredded by the enemy team. Piao in the center of this fight, dishing out damage like a, ooh, like a bully. The upheaval though, the pit is TOTs. The skewer back looks like Ace is also gonna fall. So that's three, and an Aegis being dropped. The chase is on for Piao. He's dusted up, but that dust will fall now. Rolling boulder. Mm. They ping. Do they have any way of getting him? They have a... There's the gem. They got vision. And with the astral, looks like Piao wanting to try to take someone down with him. Almost grabs LWY. Juggernaut. Inst no buybacks available up top. While we have definitely buybacks on the side of to be or not to be. Oh, the Juggernaut. Jumping in, overwhelming everyone with that Abyssal Blade. And the Axe does Yules himself up, but that's... Ha ha, GG. Fushing calls it. Rampage just got ran down. So, another 1-1 game here. Rampage did take the first game. They took a game off of Ehome as well, but now to be or not to be also takes a game. That's the thing with these best of... You know, best of twos, they just trade.